For most of us, our first forays into understanding the world around us is just our homes and our gardens and things like that, right? So just looking around our own lives can lead us to ask many questions. Curiosity, right? Why does the egg turn white when it is heated? Or, you know, why does the plant grow in a certain way? Or why is this butterfly only found on this flower? Or, you know, things like that. Just looking around our world can actually be a trigger for us to ask questions of why and how. And I think that's an important part of um, being interested in science in general and in biology. We are biology. We are human beings. Our body is made of substances that we learn in biology. So the very fact that you are interested in yourself, your body, how it works and how things work around you made me interested in biology. Biology uh, in today's world is a lot different from what it was a long time ago. It has evolved a lot and today it is a field which is a confluence of a lot of areas. To understand therefore how biological systems work, how you know phenomena are structured, I think we need an interdisciplinary approach. And the biology program at Azim Premji University basically aims to foster such a multidisciplinary and interdisciplinary understanding of biology. So we study, of course, processes that are happening at the cellular and subcellular levels, you know, how our cells are organized, how is development happening and so on and so forth. But we also focus on, say, for example, things that are happening at an individual organism's level, you know, how are different processes happening within a body. But at the same time, we also focus on ecology, you know, biogeography, things like that where we're looking at how is the world you know organized at the level of a community or a you know a set of interacting individuals students also learn uh, through lab courses they learn specific skill sets that help them become better biologists we also encourage students to go out and ask questions uh, about the natural world where students are basically studying plants birds insects and so on and so forth to bridge the gap from Having curiosity to applying it to answer questions takes, at least in my mind, two things. Pace to do it, do what you want, do the experiments. Having a, a faculty that has experience with applying their own curiosity into answering questions, which helps them to guide the students better. The strength of this program is uh, faculty sitting with students to discuss these things in detail and inculcate critical thinking about the subject. One of the things that we want to encourage as part of our program is to convert students from being consumers of information to producers of knowledge, right? Uh, and we hope that by the end of this program, students not just learn theoretical and lab skills, but are also able to question and critically examine information that is presented to them. Here, we inculcate the way of thinking in the students by asking questions, by being observant, and that is what is one of the take home for the students in order to build their personality, in order to build an integrity of character and in order to evolve as an individual as a whole.